All right, we're just uh, pulling up to the shotgun range at the Cherry Creek Reservoir Family Shooting Center. So these are the standard shotgun range rules for the pattern at least, the pattern range. Uh, auto trap shooting is that way, and you have the regular rifle and pistol range that way. So um, just make sure you remember these before you even step out on the range. Uh, make sure that all guns aren't loaded. So I'm checking to make sure this locking mechanism is fully forked. So yeah, I mean, it looks like the most of my route, most of the shot is going a little more concentrated in the left, upper left. But that's probably just uh, my poor shooting. Or it could be wind. I mean, we've got a little bit of, you know, we've got a little bit of right to left windage right now. They rent a skeet shooters, skeet throwers. This is where we're going to the auto trap. Oh, oh. Yeah, they do have your own traps where you can fire them off. Um, the one round of uh, trap uh, where someone actually does it for you automatically is $7. Um, I would highly recommend doing that just because um, you have a little bit more time and competition actually. Um, there's a lot of regulars here that like to fire. Um, both times we've been here thus far, um, it's been the same guys. So I um, highly would recommend doing that if you want to do some friendly competition, but uh, I'd recommend that area for practice. They do rent shotguns here. So the there is there is uh, some pricing here. Um, like I said, we're at Cherry Creek uh, National Park. Um, it costs you $9 to get in. Um, now you can get an annual pass um, or you can get a multi-day pass. Uh, the multi-day pass is $36 and the uh, annual pass is $73. So um, that's just to get into the park, and then you actually have to pay a range fee here, which is uh, sixteen fifty. I didn't pay actually a range fee for an auto trap. Um, I just I just paid, or the, it was seven bucks round for the auto trap. Well, then that probably so is the fee. Then. That is like the, the fee for the auto trap. So that's a pretty decent price, uh, seven bucks round, plus each round is twenty five. And you pay like seven bucks for a box of 25 shotgun shells. And he actually is correct here. So if you look at my receipt, there is no actual range fee or anything like that. Um, as you can tell, it just gives you, um, you know, the rental of the gun, the um, actual ammo, and then the fee itself. So and then here's the front office right here. Um, they do have a food truck so um, you don't have to leave the park. Um, but if you do do the day pass it does cost you nine dollars. Um, but it is valid till noon the next day. So it's essentially a pass for a day and a half if you do it right. Um, as you can tell um, the range is right behind uh, those containers there and then believe it or not they actually have an outdoor range behind that container um, as well that they open up only during the summer. Um, but there are pistol and rifle ranges here. So 
Now we're gonna go over to the rifle range and throw a few rounds down range through my AR-15. Here's my AR-15. You can set up targets at 50 yards and 100 yards. Um, it's a very good spot to kind of zero a rifle, um, and especially for hunting season. Um, I've actually helped several friends zero rifles here. They also do have spotter scopes, which are also extremely helpful. Um, you don't even have to rent those. Those are just automatically part of the stand. So um, this is a very good place to do that. Give us some commentary. Our winning range officer needs to inspect our weapon. Make sure we don't have anything that's against the rules. So, um, what would be against the rules? I think explosive rounds, theory rounds, things like that. Just kind of, you need to read the rules to make everything's good. All right, uh, inch and weird. a half, inch and a half right, and maybe a fourth of an inch down, if that. So you, so bullseye's here. You're yeah. like right here. What's your target? The center bolt. Okay. All right, final thoughts. Cherry Creek State Park Family Shooting Center. So when you come out here, um, it's very convenient. That's really the advantage here. Uh, there's lots to do. You've got shotgun ranges, you've got archery ranges, you've got rifle ranges, you've got just pistol ranges, you've got knife throwing ranges if you want to. So it's a great option uh, close to the city and uh, very affordable. All right, so final impressions of Sherry shooting, shooting range here in Sherry I like it. It's great. A little pricey, but um, you know, considering what they offer, um, you know, there are some prices that are good deals, and there are some prices that are bad. Um, overall, uh, as uh, the range scout uh, pointed out to me earlier, that uh, the range officers are kind of range Nazis a little bit, but it's better to be over safe than have no safety at all. So um, keep shooting and have a good time. Uh, and that's our review on the tree.